Hello everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It is Vinland Saga Day. I was blown away by the last episode. I was a mess. I was a mess emotionally anyway. It's been a very rough few weeks for me, but like last episode was what I think one of the best episodes of anime I've watched in a very long time. Like the episode from start to finish was just so beautiful and so well written. I watched episode eight and nine back to back and just doing that I think was just unintentionally like the best decision. <laughs> I feel like we really saw like a shift in Thorfinn's character and he wasn't processing that trauma. He was traumatized I feel like for the beginning of this season and now he's just kind of starting to process that trauma from his childhood and from being a warrior and he's trying to to move forward with his life and just watching the physical representation of being rock bottom and climbing out of that and having to try and do that over and over was just like it was just absolutely incredible and it was so beautifully directed it was so beautifully animated and written and it was just incredible and i don't know like where the season is gonna go from here i'm assuming we're still gonna get a lot of development for thorfinn and his story can kind of really begin again maybe a little bit like thor's as well but I, I don't know what to expect for this episode, but last episode was amazing. This season is amazing so far and I'm excited to get into it. So before we get into it, if you enjoy my content, please leave this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below as well. It would really help me out. But without further ado, we'll get into episode 10. Oh, look at his hair. Can I just say again, they are so ripped for people who don't get enough food. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> oh my. Oh, I'm so happy for them. Oh my god, they're so happy! <laughs> oh. They did so good! Oh my god! Oh my god, is that what he's gonna do with his change? I don't think it would be enough though. Oh my god, see if his family's still alive. Yeah. His life hasn't been his own for so many years. I think it's normal that he doesn't know what to do. Oh, the scarred hands. Oh my god, what is he? Oh, I don't think so, but I love that he wants to. Oh, maybe this is when he joins forces with Canute. If he ends up meeting with Canute again. Oh, lucky. <laughs> Very lucky, okay. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> I 
I love him so much. I'm gonna get my tissues because I think I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Look at him. Is he gonna die? Oh no. Interesting. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Who is this? Who? Or is that... Oh my god. Is that Canoe? It is. Look at his beard. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god. He's still so pretty. Oh, is this where he's from? I didn't realize it was the same village. Oh, oh my God, what? So I guess Canute's going to have to take over the proceedings. <laughs> Oh my god, we're getting child canoe and Harold. <laughs> oh, he's so tiny. <laughs> I miss the old cone head. Why can't I remember his name now? I loved him though. <laughs> The colours in this scene are so pretty. <laughs> oh, is he having a flashback? Okay, he- oh my god. <laughs> So maybe Kanu is gonna become. Can he be, be king of both? Oh my god, he does look awful. <laughs> Waiting for you so he can die? Yeah, okay. The smile. Wait, what? Wait, did he poison his own brother? Oh, I didn't realize that. Oh, oh my God, is that Kunu in the future? Whoa. <sighs> okay, so I guess his past actions are creeping up on him mentally. Wow. Of course he doesn't trust any food or drink randomly. 
Yeah. Oh my god, the fucking head in the corner. <laughs> oh my god. I did not realize that he poisoned his own brother as well. Yeah. From the pretty prince. <laughs> He's going to seem mad. Oh, this makes the memory even sadder. Oh, <laughs> he's so cute. <laughs> oh, he did. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, Ragnar. <laughs> Was that outside his window? Yeah. He seems so lonely because now he can't trust anybody because of his own actions. Obviously, while it wasn't as emotionally charged as the last episode, I feel like we learnt so much. And first of all, I don't know whether it was explicitly mentioned i think i must have missed it it just completely skipped over my head that canute poisoned harold <laughs> like i just i didn't compute that together and so it just makes it even more sad the fact that he's remembering all of these happy things that he did with his brother and he was the one who made him sick and now he's seeing like visions of like his dad's cut off head, which I mean, I guess it's not like surprising, but still, I'm also really surprised that Katil has decided to let Aina and Thorfinn go early, like as soon as the seeds are planted, because like that is, that is a big, big time skip and or not a time skip, like a big change in plans for them. And I just, uh, I mean, we'll see if it actually happens. I don't know why, but I just have this really bad feeling that now that he said that and he's going to go see King Canute now, I just have this really bad feeling that Katil might die like on the trip or something. And then his promises to the slaves will be null and void because he might be dead. I don't know. Maybe I'm just like, I don't want to, I don't want to linger on the happiness too much because I want to prepare myself uh, just in case things go downhill. But that was a really good episode. I also, oh my God, seeing Aina and Thorfinn laugh together made me so emotional. Like I, I am so happy that they can both laugh and smile together now. And I feel like we've never seen Thorfinn really laugh like that, like since he was a child. It was just really beautiful and heartwarming to see. I, that was probably like my favorite scene of the entire episode, to be honest, like just seeing the, the pure joy on both of their faces after they cut down the last tree. Like that was amazing. I am really excited for the next episode and to see what happens. I have a feeling Canute and Thorfinn might end up working together because Thorfinn has a pretty big goal of wanting to end war and slavery, which I don't see how that's going to happen. But also Canute has brought a lot of peace already and doesn't want slavery in his lands. So maybe they're going to work together 
and meet back up. Maybe we'll see that next episode or maybe we won't. I'm not too sure, but I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for watching. Also, before I end this, I just want to let you know that next week I won't be able to react straight away to the episode because I will be away for a week. I've still got a couple of uploads planned, but I won't physically be at my computer so I can't record. So I'll react to episodes 11 and 12 in two weeks. So just a heads up with that as well. If you have any thoughts, please leave them in the comments down below. I'll also leave all of my socials down below as well. I've got Twitter, Instagram, a book YouTube channel if books are your thing. And I also stream on Twitch as well. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day or night wherever you are. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.